Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. I know it's been quite a while, so uh, let's catch up. Okay, so today is currently July 3rd, 2020. The last time that I actually uploaded a video was March 5th, and yeah so you guys know that um the world has gone crazy and i just haven't been uploading anything so a couple of things as you guys probably are aware march 13th was the last day i was in the classroom so uh march 13th was the week of spring break and then we were told we were doing e-learning for the rest of the year so it was a big change, but I personally liked it. Um, I feel like I got uh, better connections with some of my students, the students who were like always there on my Zoom meetings and stuff. So I really enjoyed it. Um, was it perfect? No, but did it work for the last quarter? Of course. So with the new school year coming up, um, you know, we're kind of at a loss of what is going to happen. Um, we don't know from one day to the next what's happening. Parents are the ones making the decisions. They haven't asked the teachers anything. Um, and I have lots and lots of thoughts on going back to school in the midst of this coronavirus. If you don't know already, um, I live in Florida, so I'm a Florida teacher and Again, if you've watched the news, um, we have been having our record numbers. So how they think we can go back to a tr traditional school setting um, back in August or in August coming up is ridiculous to me. <laughs> and teachers actually go back like July 30th or 31st. Um, so anyway, I have lots to say about that, but I will save that for a, another video. So today what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually do an unboxing. This is from Joanne Fabrics. Now I don't know about you guys but during the coronavirus I have um, kind of developed a shopping uh, addiction <laughs> basically an online shopping addiction um, and so I'm trying to curve out of it but um, so far I just, there's nothing else to do. <laughs> I love getting stuff in the mail, so yay. Anyway, uh, so two packages came. I think that there's like two more packages coming next week. I honestly like don't even remember what I purchased, but they were all on super sale. So I did not pay full price for anything. Plus I got my 15% um, teacher discount as well. So yay for that. Um, so let's go ahead and get into it. So I have two little packages. The first one is this bag, which I think I do kind of know what's in here. So this is my thought on this. Um, I, for next year, have become the wellness champion for my school. So I'm super excited about that. Basically what that means is, um, is I'll be kind of putting together some workout sessions, maybe a walking group, um, putting out recipes and different things like that. So I kind of want to do like a monthly challenge and I've already set up one for August, which I'm super excited about. Um, but anyway, for prizes and stuff, I was thinking a cool prize would be like a dollar water mug from the Dollar Tree and then using my Cricut to maybe say their name or say like wellness winner or something with that. So with that being said, I got these Cricut uh, vinyl little things. So I don't know if the lighting is really picking this up, but this has um, three sheets and they're uh, glitter. It's got pink, silver, and this like teal color. Can you see that there? You can kind of see it. So that's that. Um, and you see like you can do different things like that. So, so um, yes, I'm excited. And it's permanent. So once you stick it on, it should permanently be there. Um, another one that I got. 
these are, let's see, there are six of these and these are like primary colors. So like those. And let's see, this one's permanent as well and it's glossy. And then I picked up, oh, hmm. Did I really do that? <laughs> I guess I picked up a second one of the primary colors. Um, so yeah, our school is, um, the school colors are red, white, and blue. Um, but I think the primary colors will be awesome for that. So got those three things. And then the other thing that I got was, in this bag anyway, is this notes classic happy planner notes can you see that Woo. um so i used to be really into happy planner stuff <laughs> um used to like buy the kits on etsy and different things like that i however do not do that anymore um because really who has time for that um so with the whole like teaching and being home all the time now though, I have realized that I really do like using a planner to kind of track out my days and obviously plan for the week. Um, so what I have been using right now is a classic happy planner uh, with the, obviously the days of the week and the three like boxes. So the boxes are what I've been kind of doing is like maybe life stuff um work and then exercise so then i'll plan those three things out so that's what i've been doing and so far i'm really liking it but i'm like you know with school and everything let me see if i can get one of those so this obviously is not a planner but um it's a note section which i like um plus you can put some of these notes in your classic happy planner and kind of do a mix match of different things so the tape or like the sticky stuff got on my i don't like that anyway <laughs> um so this is the cover and i love it so much so i could actually put this cover onto my happy planner it says the world let's see Oh, <laughs> the world was hers for the reading, and then it has all of the awesome uh, books here, and I am a seventh grade reading teacher, so I do love that. And then the back has, uh, let me get this sticky stuff off, uh, the back is really nice as well. It has the books on the back. Now, what's cool about these covers, though, is that you can actually... Uh, reverse it and you could use this if you wanted um, so this would be like your um, front of the planner and it just says live creatively which I always really like I could put like my name here with the vinyl stuff that I got um, so lots of different options which I really like plus I like this um, because of the rings. These rings though do seem smaller than the rings in your classic planner, but I'm not 100% sure with that. But anyway, like I said, this is the notes. So it does have three tabs. Oh, these are awesome. Look at this one. I don't know if you can read that, but it says, I just want to read books and take naps. So love that. <laughs> Let's see what the other tab says. The littlest things are where we find the most joy. So that's super cute. And then the last tab, whoops, is you are so great. So I love those and they're blank. And what's cool about them too is that they just have like a blank on the other side. So um, you could repurpose them for anything. And then the actual note pages just look like this. So I love that. Um, it's got the little stars. I love color, so I'm happy about that. And again, I think I got this for very inexpensive. Um, so yay. <laughs> okay, next I have this huge box, which again, I don't really know what's in here. Um, I did get some planner stickers and I did get a teacher planner as well. 
So we will see what I got. I got paper <laughs> and ooh, some cool stuff. Let's first do. <laughs> I might have went overboard on this. Um. But that's okay. <laughs> I'll have lots of things to label, right? Um, and by the way, the Cricut that I have is very old. It's the one that like still uses cartridges. So let me know down below, do you have a new uh, Cricut? And if you do, is it worth the money? So let me know down below. I do like the idea that you can like basically make anything <laughs> because it's all like computer based, I believe. Correct me if I'm wrong, but anyway. Um, so I got another set. I got three sets of this. I don't, I have to look back <laughs> and see if that's correct. But anyway, this is kind of what I want to do with it though. You see, they have the little bee there on the cup. I think this would be such a cute way to um, make a cute little gift. And then I could put like little stuff inside. <laughs> so, um, so yay. I'm excited about that. So I got another one with the primary colors, and then I got this one. Now this one is removable matte. So um, this one has, let's see, 12 of all of these colors, which is awesome. But these are removable. So this one I would probably use more for like my classroom board or anything like that. And then the rest of them, the permanent ones, I would do on the cups for the wellness prizes. So. Yeah, for that. Okay, the next stuff is mostly happy. Well, it is all happy planner stuff. <laughs> so, and again, I believe I got really good deals on these, but I' not even gonna guess the prices on these. <laughs> so, uh, the first one I have is the which one is this? The Teacher's Rule, um, seven hundred and eighty-six piece sticker book. Love this. Um, I was looking at the different ones and this one just seemed like the one that I would use the most. The way that I plan, I, you know, I like to make it pretty, like don't get me wrong, but I am really more the functional thing and I love that it comes with these. So this is because my planner that I got is um, undated. So the little tabs, I can put these on there and then, um, you know, give each tab a month. So really love those. So I'm really glad that those were included. Um, and just has like these little things, you know, little like not quotes, but like when open house is, when back to school is, different things like that. Um, holidays, <laughs> that's what I'm trying to say. Um, so yeah, so just like cute little things. I love it. It's cute. Oh, look at these. Those are so cute. I love it. It's got the little notebooks and the pens and pencils. I love it. I love this type of thing. I really do. Oh, look, early release ones. We have lots of early releases usually, so I love it. Ooh, parent meeting. I like it. I like these little like quote boxes that they have just in case you want to hide something. So, yay. I am super excited. So, love that. Definitely going to get some use out of that one. Woohoo. Um, the next thing I got was more notes. So, this one is kind of cute. It's got the teal at the top and um, just says notes. Just nice and clean looking. Um, so I love these. I Again, you can put these in your classic uh, classic planner, but you can also use it in your notebook as well. So that's exciting. Then I got this, which this looks... Oh no, did I not get this right? Hmm. I don't know. I'll have to look. This is supposed to, I think, fit the classic... But anyway, this is the little, um, what are they calling this? There are 99 pieces in here, what? Um, these are planner accessories, so I'll just open it up and take a look at it. This is probably going to be a super long um, video. I apologize, uh, but that's okay. I haven't seen you guys in a while, so 
Hopefully you're sticking with me. <laughs> okay, so let's see what we got here. So the first thing is, boop, boop, boop. Oh, maybe everything looks so pretty with this plastic. Okay, so we have a little bookmark here, which is awesome. You can put a little tab on here if you want. Oh, it's got little plastic on here. Um, There we go. Uh, so I love that you could put a tab up here and saying like um, this week or today um, and or monthly. I've heard some people do that as well. And it says the future of the world is in my classroom today. So love that. I love the colors. So cute. Um, so there's that. Okay. There's the. Ah. These are so cute. Okay. So. Okay, um, so it has some more stickers. So here are the stickers for that. Yay, I love the cactus. Cacti, cactus, whatever. <laughs> Make a point to be kind, love that. So, um, love those. Um, yay. So, love the color, love those. Then it's got a folder, which I really like. Now, if you are looking for something, um, the thing about the Happy Planners, though, is that the sizing is a little bit different. So, with the classic size is not a regular 8x10. The big size planner is a regular 8x10, which is great. However, even their planners like this will not hold an actual 8x10 piece of paper. So, I went with the classic. Um, yeah, I'll just fold things if I really need to, um, or I'll keep like a separate thing for actual like handouts that we get. I'll just put it in like a three ring binder or something. So I'm not too worried about it, but love this, the black and white with the little um, apples and there is a front and back uh, folder. So very cute. And then look how cute these notes are. I love them so much. So how cute is that with the little pencil? And then it's got little apples and then the apples transfer on the back as well. So cute. So I think there's probably like 50, 50 sheets or something. Um, it probably said on that piece of paper that I threw on the ground. Um, but love that. And then last, but certainly not least, is my school planner for this year of 2020 2021 so this is a 12 month planner it is undated and it is a horizontal layout so let me kind of show you a little bit about this so oh somebody's trying to contact me i feel so special <laughs> okay well Oh, they have one of these things on the back of my planner. I have a feeling that that is not going to come off very easily. <laughs> oh well. Um, so this is it says school days, which I like it, and it has a cute little um, apple on the back. But remember, I could use the other one though too. Or another thing that I thought of is I could use this. I love yellow, it makes me so happy. So I really do love the yellow as well. Um, now these are the plastic rings, but you see how much bigger they are than the um, notebook ones, which I'm a little disappointed. I thought for some reason that the um, notebook ones would be the same size as the silver. Not the case, so I was gonna switch them over, especially if I use the yellow inside, but that's okay. I have black discs, but I don't have silver, so that's cool. Um, and then let's look inside real quick. Let me move this. Because in a teacher planner, I believe you get a few extra things. I could be wrong about that though. Um, Oh, for some reason, I thought that I was going to get be getting some some things. I don't know. Because this is undated, though, um, it does come with little stickers for the months, and then you get, you know, obviously the front page. Um, this is the first time that I'm doing the Happy Planner. It has for like the substitutes. It has additional notes here at the front. Um, and then this is kind of what 
it looks like. So here is our monthly uh, goals. And then it has your tab on it. I personally love the colors. Um, so that's cool. Oh, and they do uh, kind of correlate. So not that. Let me see. And then for the monthly, it's just like a little bit of, um, I don't know, confetti, I guess, up here. But the rest is pretty plain. And then for the actual layout, it just has a color that it has. So I wanted to show you just a little bit about this. So on this side, it has four boxes. And this is Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. So it only has the five days a week which I think is fine. Um, I'm a little worried because I'm like, well, what about the weekends? <laughs> but I guess that's where like your notes come in. You could add that to it or whatever. Um, so the way that I plan on doing this though is I have three classes, um, three block classes. So I would um, label these like block one, block two, block three, and see what we're doing. I don't teach really, the same thing so really the days should be pretty much the same but over here this is where I would keep like my meetings um what else let's see meetings exercise maybe like meal lunch plan and then miscellaneous or the weekend or something like that so that's kind of my plan I have not um ever planned like this before and Normally, I don't really plan for the school, like, in something like this. Um, so, something new <laughs> to do. Uh, so, yeah. So, I really like it. I really like how the colors kind of, like, coordinate and everything. Love that so much. Okay. So, um, the battery is going down. Oh, look at this one. I love the green. See the foil? Ooh, so nice. Okay. So, um, I would highly recommend this <laughs> this one i was looking at a lot of the, their different planners and i was just not like thrilled with them for the for this year for some reason um but i really like this one really excited um and it's cool too that it doesn't have the months on there because you could switch this all around and if for some reason like i decide that i don't really want to continue planning this way I could always still use the um, divider sheets but then just get um, like a traditional inserts and stuff so super excited about that um they have a Dolly Parton quote in here how cute is that look how just nice the the thing matches I love I love I love color and I love things that match so Super excited about that. Um, so yeah. Okay. Oh, like, look at this. Oh, I love it so much. Okay. So anyway, that is my little, not so little, um, Johan Fabric haul. Um, I do have a couple more boxes coming. I do not quite understand what it pops possibly could be in the other boxes. Um might be though some extra like note paper because I think it was on super duper sale of like a dollar ninety nine and like I said the paper is not your regular eight by ten um notebook paper so I was like well let me grab this up because I really don't feel like cutting my own paper and different things like that. I do have a whole punch so I could if I wanted to um but I just Who's got time for that, right? Not me. <laughs> so thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you will see me um, sooner rather than later. <laughs> and um, a couple of things that I've been thinking about maybe filming is I just redid my um, office, my home office. So that's I love it. I'm so excited about it. So if you want to see that, let me know in the comments below. And what else? I do have a few um, things that I found on e-learning. Some like great um, 
what do I want to say, like resources, I guess, for e-learning. So I will probably be making a video on that soon as well. And then, yeah, I will be updating you with what we decided to do for next year. Um, it's still up in the air. <laughs> so anyway, I will chat with you guys later. And I hope you guys have a fabulous rest of your summer. Bye. And don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Bye.